Welcome to Aspen, Colorado, you guys. We got in yesterday. I am obsessed with Aspen. I belong here, okay? It is so bougie and classy and just good vibes and mellow, but also really fun. Just good vibes all around. So I thought I would vlog today for you guys and take you along. I think we're gonna go into town maybe. I don't know, the plans always change, so don't quote me on this, but probably gonna like shop around. I wanna buy skis really, really badly because I'm like actually a good skier and I feel like I'll get use out of them. So, and it's like kind of always annoying to like have to rent stuff. Also, I'm getting ready right now. So I wanted to like see, they have like really good shopping here. I also have nothing to wear for New Year's, but I don't know if I'll find anything here. I'll probably end up boring something from some of one of the other girls here yeah I just I definitely want to go shopping because Aspen has really good shopping they have like Prada and like Balenciaga and like high-end stores so that's exciting but for now I'm just getting ready I'm gonna do my makeup and get ready for the day so let's do it um, I wanted to give you guys a little house tour. I was kind of like doing some videos on my phone yesterday. So definitely make sure you guys are following me on Instagram. Also make sure you're subscribed to this channel. I never say that shit. I should probably say that more like in the beginning of my videos. But I always forget. Make sure you subscribe and turn those post notifications on. And follow me on Instagram because yesterday I was doing like videos of when we got to Aspen. And I didn't vlog anything yesterday. But it's kind of hard to like do like videos on stories. And then um, also vlog. So sometimes I do like one or the other. More like vlog style stories. So make sure you're following me. But yeah, we're just gonna do our makeup and I'll catch up with you guys after that. Alright guys, this is the only full me full length mirror in the house, but it's on this door thing, but this is the outfit of the day. Everything is basically Revolve. Got this sweater, so cute, it's like collared, has this little shoulder detail, it's so cute. The hat is actually, I think it's from Urban Outfitters, like so long ago, but it's so cute. And then my pants, the ones I wear all the time from Redone, and then these shoes are from Revolve, super cute. I'm obsessed, I definitely need to take a photo in this, it's so cute. And then I'm bringing this jacket too, but we're headed out to the town. I'll definitely show you guys the house when I get back, but let's go shopping. All right, guys, I'm driving in the snow because I'm the only good driver in the Sarah's snow. Driving. Better <laughs> it's a Canadian. Because she's Canadian, so she knows how to drive in the snow. I think I'm gonna get this bag. I feel like it's very New Year's Eve, good going out bag. What do you guys think? Should I get it? This headband is so cute, but so big. <laughs> So Alright guys, so we're back. We went through the town today. I did a little shopping and I thought I would show you guys what I got. Basically, that's all we did. We just walked around. We got lunch. Everywhere is super busy here. I love it. It's just very, I don't know. Everyone's here. I just feel like it's so fun. I'm glad we came and tomorrow we're going skiing. I did get a ski outfit because I have a ski outfit, but I have a ski outfit for like when it's like sunny out and it's like you're almost like too hot, you know? Like it's like a jumpsuit. It's not that thick. It's one of those Cordova things so I needed something a little warmer so I got a Goldberg like situation and then I got something else so I just thought I would show you guys um so yeah we're going skiing tomorrow and tomorrow's New Year's Eve actually so tomorrow's New Year's Eve <laughs> skiing all day and then probably just come home get ready for New Year's Eve okay so the outfit that I got was from this place it's very popular <laughs> in Aspen they have like all of the brands for like ski outfits and whatever and I was kind of rushed but hopefully I gotta try it on I don't I think it's gonna be like a like a size small I think I looked it up and it was like small I would probably need an extra small but maybe I'll just go a little bigger for like a ski outfit I don't know but anyway I went with like plain black or white and black this is the jacket I really wanted like just a clean jacket with a belt like I just love the ones with belts because it cinches you in at the waist and I just think they're so flattering and this one actually comes with a another belt which I kind of like better I might switch it out 
just like a little bit more different stands out more so and it has like a little fur hood yeah i got it in a size six with six which i think i need a four i don't know i tried this on but i didn't try the pants on so that's what i'm a little worried about we will see hopefully <laughs> i'm gonna try it on right now actually but these are the pants that i got they're matching i just thought like the white white like looks good together these have like knee pads which i thought was kind of badass <laughs> and they're just like has a belt too also a size six so yeah, I'm gonna try that on together. Hopefully it looks good. If not, I'll have to return it. And then we went to Prada. And they have like all the bougie stores here. It's like so cute. I don't have a Prada. I don't have much Prada. I don't have a Prada bag. And I saw this bag and I've been seeing it a lot. And I know they're hard to find. They're like one of the hardest ones of these bags to find. So I was like, you know what? I think I just, it's meant to be because I also, it's meant to be for New Year's. Let me, let me just open it for you guys. So this is the box, a little unboxing. <laughs> it was the only one in the store too. The only one left. It's just perfect for New Year's. <laughs> but I, I, I've never owned, like, you know, I don't know. These bags are like everywhere and they're pretty popular. And I just feel like this is so cute for New Year's and also just any going out like Vegas, Miami. It's just a really good going out bag. And also we're going to St. Bart's after this. We're going straight to St. Bart's, which I feel like this would be going out bag there too. Very cute nighttime bag. So I feel like surprisingly, like it goes with a lot. Like this would like literally be cute with this. And I know they're like really, they're like a more hard to find bag. I got it and I may, I really love it. And it's really sparkly and cute. And I also, I don't have a like sequin sparkly bag. And I, especially during the holiday time, I always, like a small one, I'm always trying to find one and I don't, I don't have one. So that was really cute. Got that. I love it. So yeah, that was my little haul, my little Aspen haul. I do want to still buy skis. I think we're going to try to get up early, even though that's always really difficult for me. I think we're just going to go to dinner tonight though, and hopefully it'll be an early night and we can wake up early and go buy skis and go skiing. But I'm going to try this on and show you guys one sec. Y'all, it fits and I'm so happy. I don't have to return it. It's so cute. Let me show you. Let me show you. I switched the belt too. This belt is so much cuter. Okay, so this is the jacket. I love the furriness and then I feel like the size is good because I can like layer like right now I'm not wearing even a shirt under it I'm like naked so I feel like once I'm wearing like a sweater under it too it'll be good those are the pants they fit perfect I'm so happy I think it fits good success all right so I'm gonna get ready for dinner I'll show you guys my outfit and everything when I'm ready all right guys this is the outfit this lighting is so bad I apologize but this is the outfit I am wearing these leather pants, my thigh high boots, my new purse. Felt like wearing it, and then this like brown turtleneck tucked in, and then I'm wearing this bougie ass thing around my head. Better lighting. What's up guys? It's New Year's Eve and we are gonna go skiing today. I'm super excited. I'm ready. It is 9.50 a.m. We're gonna eat breakfast and then go. I'm gonna vlog on my phone like as much as possible, but it should be fun. And then I'm gonna come back and get ready for New Year's, but I'm really excited. Let me know, do you guys have New Year's resolutions? Do you think resolutions are stupid? I think it's always like an excuse to like better yourself. So like any excuse to do that is good. You gotta stick with it. Like I don't like when people like, oh, like I'm gonna make my New Year's resolution and then they like fail like a week later like they just use it as an excuse i feel like you can kind of do a new year's, new year's resolution any time of year i think new year's is good because it gives you an excuse to really actually do it if that makes sense i don't know i'm really tired but i think my year's new year's ugh, i can't talk i think it's just a good time to like reflect on this past year and like see what you can better yourself with or what you want to do better or what you don't want to do or anything like that it's just a good time to like reflect and all that and think about like what makes you happy what makes you not happy and then just kind of go from there also just like think about like what lessons you learned in the past year just kind of grow from it grow from it and each year you know everyone's growing and even like your fails of the year like that's stuff that you can grow from and learn from. So I think it's just reflecting, see what you failed this year, or what you did good and just reflect. And I don't know if that makes sense, but yeah. Also this vlog is gonna be sponsored by Obey. They are a fitness platform and they are like my new favorite way to work out at home. Makes it so easy. You can literally watch the workouts from your TV or your laptop, which is good because it's like a big screen. Sometimes when I'm like 
watching stuff on my phone. Like I can't even see what they're doing. And they have like all different workouts, like HIIT workouts, strength, Pilates, sculpts. I think Pilates is like my favorite one though. So this is what it looks like. This is their home page. It's like that. And then this is the page with like all the classes on it. So cute and pink. Um, but you can scroll through all of them and just pick the one you want to do. It's super easy. Yeah, they have yoga, sculpt, dance, cardio. That sounds so fun. They have like meditation. They literally have every type of workout you could think of. Bar. And they have really good instructors too. They're like the best of the best from New York City. And they all have like areas of expertise. There's literally something for everyone. I think I'm going to do a little pre-workout or like stretch before we go skiing because I don't want to be sore. So I want to do something like chill and like maybe yoga. So I'm going to do a little workout. Ooh, okay. I'm going to do the vinyasa yoga calming morning flow. That sounds good and chill. Hello, hello, Obey fam. I'm Francesca, and this Francesca. is We just finished the workout. It was really easy. It was a quick 10 minute like yoga stretch with Francesca. <laughs> I love it so much. I love Obey. They're amazing, like working out when you're traveling, so easy. I literally could have put it on that TV. I just don't really know how to do that. <laughs> but I travel everywhere with my laptop, so super easy. They're really, really awesome. They have like 7,000 on-demand classes, 22 live classes a day. You can take them live in the moment. And they have all class levels, so beginner, intermediate, advanced. They have like prenatal stuff, so definitely check them out. I'll put the link in the description box. If you guys want a new way to work out, they're really, really amazing. See ya. on the plane. I've never seen so much snow. They're like de-icing it and it's like a whole process. Like the, the window's literally frozen. Yes, One sec. Literally ice everywhere. There's snow on the wing. So we're waiting for that and then we're gonna take off. We are headed to Miami right now and then tomorrow we're just sleeping there for a night and then tomorrow we're headed to St. Bart's. What's that? So yeah, there's sandwiches and chips there. Ooh. Anyways, I think that's going to be it for the Aspen vlog. I hope you guys liked it. I will try to film as much as I can in St. Bart's if I decide to film. But I love you guys so, so much, and I'll see you in St. Bart's. Bye, guys.